Hi, my goal today is going to be to show you several different ways to wrap your knees. I'm going to show you, I'm going to start with a basic way to wrap your knees, a slightly more advanced way to wrap your knees, and then lastly, I'm going to show you my preferred way to wrap your knees with the preferred wraps that I use um, for competition. Now all the wraps that I'm using today will be from APT Power Wraps. Um, as far as I'm concerned, they're the highest performing wraps on the market today. Um, you really need to give them a try if you're serious about your knee wraps. Um, well, let's get on with it. Okay, for the sake of this demonstration, I have 415 on the bar. I normally don't even wrap for this amount of weight, but again, just to demonstrate wrapping my knees in a couple of different methods and a little bit of the results that I'll get. Um, and again, I'm going to go heavier. These wraps are awesome APT wraps. Um, they just have more radical wraps that I use um, for competition, which you'll see later in this video. This is the most basic way to wrap your knees, right here. Starting at the bottom, catch it, overlap a little bit, about half the wrap is what they say, work your way to the top. I may not be pulling quite as tight as I could. But again, for this weight, it doesn't matter. And I'm going to show you a little trick because with some of the wraps nowadays, this top, as you see, I'm not having a ton of success with it. Uh, one of the ways that I like to use is it's called the bow time method. Same thing though. After I get that, I start at the bottom, work them all the way to the top. But rather than have to talk now, tie them off. Less energy exerted here, more energy saved for up there on the bar. Again, this is 415. This is when I have to do my talking because when I go a little heavier, I'll be a little more focused on uh, my performance here rather than the video. So this is this is 415 with some basic training wraps. my knees this time with the wraps that I use in a contest. Again, from APT. Uh, these wraps are probably, for me, um, they're the, as radical as I like to go. They have heavier duty wraps. Um, other people may like them. Um, for the purpose of this demonstration, I don't have my belt on because I put them on that on after I wrap my knees. Um, the next set, this I have the bar loaded at 505, and for the next set I'm hoping to do 575, and I may not do a lot of talking. Now after I wrap my knees, I'm going to move my camera into position, put my belt on, do this rep, then I'm going to rest and I'll do the 575 without any further instructions. You guys have it by now. Again my preferred way to wrap knees. I'm going to use the bow tie method on both sides. Now I want to make sure I'm pulling tight. I like to crisscross across my knees at least once because I don't want any exposed skin 
when I squash. That bugs the hell out of me. I'm not sure if you squat more with that crisscross on your knee. <laughs> but it makes me feel better. Done. 